previously in our last episode. You can get a lot more in nowadays with, with uh, you know. Double fisting. And just ahead. I have never said that. Get those nuts away from my face. OG Creations is filmed before a live studio audience. Of two cats. here from OG Creations. We're getting closer and closer to that big day. What day? That some of you have waited for all year long. This is Halloween. This is Halloween. No, not that one. That's me. That's the one. Christmas. That one day a year that must be pre-prison, Martha Stewart perfect. It's a jolly good thing. And if it isn't, your past year and your entire upcoming year have been catastrophically ruined. <laughs> By now, I hope all of your holiday shopping is completed and those presents are already perfectly wrapped underneath the tree. Your holiday cards have been sent that includes that idyllic family photo, including all of your pets, right there on the cover. And that the big day menu has been planned, shopped for, and prop has already started. It's the most wonderful time of year, isn't it? Who needs a cocktail? Me, 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 me! A couple of weeks ago, I... You know what? Screw it. Just take it back. <laughs> Some random holiday channel on Apple One Music when the Christmas song came on. Did you know? What is it you can't face? That that song was just called the Christmas song? Get the fuck out of here! I guess I never knew the title. When you're listening to the lyrics, it's just a lot of random facts. And then my mind instantly thinks, could this possibly be the 1946 precursor? Anyway, while we were listening to the song, and like most songs that I listen to, my mind started to change the lyrics and make it not safe for work. For example, Jack Frost was sipping on my hose. I love how the Jack Frost collection turned out, especially the video for Hanukkah. But no matter how hard I try, I cannot get that first line of the song out of my head. Chestnuts roasting on an open fire. Ah! Let's make a mini collection for that one too. The Christmas song is our inspiration again. I'm going to flambe me some juicy nuts by bleaching out some black jocks, briefs, and thongs, and then apply a hot, bright yellow. Then I'll use the geotechnique and add in some fiery shades of orange and red. All right, everyone, gird your loins. Because we're roasting ourselves up some hefty nuts on an open fire. It hurts so bad, mommy. Let's get started. Okie dokie, let's get started. I'm starting with the ever so popular Nike Dry Fit Essential Cotton Jock Straps in black. I'm bleaching out the pouch and the straps so I have a clean neutral base. When I've used regular bleach in the past on my jock straps, the waistband turns this horrible gray color and it's really hard to get any color to stick to it. I thought I would test using the bleach gel here to see if I can keep the waistband black. Once the bleach is applied, I set it aside for 25 minutes in a warm space around 70 degrees. I run them through the washer using a quick tap water rinse cycle. I then rinse them in a soda ash bath for 25 minutes and then set them aside for 24 hours until they were practically dry. I then dip dye them in a bright yellow liquid dye. They are set aside for 2-3 to three hours. This is the geotechnique sped up to 647%. I gather the material into a wadded up section and secure it with rubber bands.
Liquid dyes are now applied. Here I'm using Deep Orange and Chinese Red. I set it aside for 48 hours to cure in a 70 degree space. They are rinsed in cold water and then I slowly increased the temperature to hot to ensure that all the soda ash had been removed. I then run them through the laundry using a cold water cycle and then a hot water cycle. After being dried, ironed, and placed into inventory, I add it to my Etsy store ready to purchase. You can get this and similar items by clicking the link above or by visiting ogcreationstore.etsy.com. These are brilliant! I absolutely love using these colors and this technique on mins, briefs, and thongs. They just make your dick look like it's on fire. And even though you don't want the burning sensation, who doesn't like a good fire crotch? I have never said that. Get those nuts away from my face. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions or you just want to leave a comment, make sure to do so in the comment section below. I love responding to everyone. Plus, it really does help with this goddamn algorithm for new viewers to find the channel. And that's the whole point anyway. So comment away. As always, make sure to like and subscribe. And I'll see you next week. Happy Holidays!